It's the end of an era tonight at 50th and Dodge in Omaha. Last call in just a few hours at the old Dundee Bar. The renovation of the movie theater is squeezing out the neighborhood tavern. Reporter Miranda Christian was there tonight where folks are drowning their sorrows and remembering the good times. The old Dundee Bar off 50th and Dodge has been a staple for decades. But plans to renovate the Dundee Theater are forcing the bar to serve their last drink. And I've been coming here since I was 21. I'm 29 right now. Boy, that was way back in the late 60s and early 70s. <laughs> Thursday night was the last night for the old Dundee Bar. There's been uh, a lot of celebrations here. There's been a lot of heartbreak and like crazy, crazy nights here. And yeah, it's definitely very sad. This place, it's an end of an era very much like the years of Tuesday afternoon pool playing is going to be a pretty huge memory for us for a lot of years to come. As the last beers are poured and the last games of pool are played, the memories from over the years shine. I had my first legal beer at the Dundee Dell. I met my fiance here about three years ago at the pool tables and uh, we've been coming here and celebrating and making a lot of memories. The loss of the bar was so sad for Stephanie Dworak, she got a tattoo. It's just a little gravestone with a gin and tonic being poured out over it. As everyone gathers to say goodbye, one thing is clear, <laughs> Old Dundee Bar will be missed. It's just one of, it's my favorite bar. It means a lot to me. It's always been a good neighborhood bar. I mean, it's a good way to say farewell, but hopefully not for too long. Yeah! I spoke with film streams today who said they should start work on the new Dundee Theater in February and they hope to have it completed by 2018. Reporting in Dundee, I'm Miranda Christian, KMTV Action 3 News. And cheers to all the good folks who turned out there tonight. By the way, you can still own a piece of the old Dundee's history. Owners plan to sell off everything from the pool table to the chairs at an auction set for January 29th. That sale will also include the beer draft system, freezers, ranges, and fryers. You can find a link to the story at our website, kmtv.com.